What's up guys, Anthony here. We're back, we're in business. We're at a Coastal Customs. We're gonna be doing some work with Lewis. You guys know Lewis. What's up? We're gonna be doing business with this guy, showing you his builds, right at his store. This is where we're gonna be at for a little while. Uh, we're gonna be, we're gonna be also doing the Can-Am over there. So we'll be doing a video on that too. But we're gonna be creating more content for you now because it's just me and Lewis, there's not many crazy things going on. We get to do the work nice, have our own pace, and have everything working good. So I'm glad we're back. Welcome to the channel again, guys. We're gonna be doing a lot of content. Let's see what we got going on. Okay, first of all, this is the customer's own stuff. His woofers, this is the box we did for him, ported. Boom, look at that port. Looks real nice. So we did the ported box. Uh, let's go show you the stuff he's gonna be working in. This is stuff we're throwing in. We got the monoblock amp for the hot for the subwoofers. We got the radio, four channel, front speakers, and the dash speakers. Really cool stuff. Oh, and he also has his own epicenter. We're gonna be working on that one as well. Cool guys. Let's let's get it. Let's get it. Let's see him work. Okay. How about that? already removed the whole dash uh, he's running the cables these are the cables we're gonna be running remote wire subwoofer wire 4 channel then we got our 4 gauge wire on this side for the 2 amps nice how long did it take you to finish this car five days six six days Okay, six days guys, just kidding. It's like six hours. But yeah, let's do it. Four highs. This is the four channel. See that? Under the seat. Uh, let's show them the the base one. This is gonna show you the base amp. Can you see it good? Kind of. That's the epicenter and the base amp. But out. Also, look at these two badass tans right here. Loving it, really digging this box. Has a cutout for the seat belt, which is nice, and it's ported. Cool. There's the radio. Here's the radio, so you guys can see the radio. Looking great, looking great, looking gravy. Que mas quieres, gente? What else you want? Come down, see us, get your cars done by the pros, and yeah. We'll watch him take apart the doors and change the speakers. Peace.
Okay, so I want to show you something about the dash speakers. They took it out. This is what it looks like. And I want to show you the kicker speakers. What's cool about the kickers is that it comes with plates. Let me see the plates. This one. It comes with these plates. There's, there's a couple different ones. There's Chevy, there's Ford, and the Subaru, Toyota. All these different plates. But this is the Dodge ones. They come with other ones. So they match up perfectly with the original speaker and then they have their own speaker which they're gonna go inside this little pivot right here this is the speaker the kicker it's a little 2.5 i believe it's the model number they fit beautiful on the dash they sound really good for the price and uh allows you to get a little bit more higher end than this cool see they fit perfect and they're mounted and then another thing is uh kicker provides these base blockers which will allow the speaker to stay protected. Cool. Oh, and by the way, Lewis has this cool little tool. You can like do some weird bends and go crazy. He has this tool so he can get in there and get the speaker out. Because it's very difficult to get in there with the windshield. This thing comes in handy. That's the company who sells it. Put out, put in, put out. And also, by the way, guys, you see this handle? Inside the handle, there's a little clip. See that clip? that clip needs to come out and how do we get to the clip they got this beautiful tool you can buy it from anywhere it doesn't have to be snap on this is probably five thousand dollars because it's from snap on but harbor freight has it for eight forty nine <laughs> so it pretty much goes inside here and it pushes the clip out and when it pushes the clip out you're able to take the door handle out such a beautiful thing oh just so you can see there's two plates they're gonna sandwich the speaker together to make it stay. Oh, let me see that. That's gangster, bro. Personal. I like it. Back to work. Done and over with. The customer's gonna pick it up. Glad you guys got to see it. It was enjoyable. But I do want to hit you up with a little bit of B roll because what's the video without B roll? Show the B roll, baby. Three, two, one. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is it. That's the episode. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoy. We'll be giving it to Can Am next. Uh, that's going to be taking the Rockford Fosgate Stage 6 system. I'm going to record that today, and we should be good. Comment, like, subscribe. Also, like I said, we're in business. We're going to be doing a lot more stuff for you guys. Stay tuned. Peace.